Hi Mecca Beauty Junkies, it's Dominica and Annabelle. So today we're trying out some really wild fun beauty trends, so keep watching. So the first trend we're trying out today is the color bold eye look. We've been seeing it all over Instagram. I'm gonna be trying out a yellow and you're gonna be doing lime. Let's get started. I'm actually gonna use a liquid lipstick as my base today. So this is the Key Lime Truffle from the MAC O Sweetie collection. And I'm just using a gorgeous yellowy gold shade called Goldfinger from NARS. I'm just taking this all over my eyelid. Liquid lipsticks make really good eye bases because they set matte and they just help the pigment in your eyeshadow to pop so much more. So I'm just packing this shadow all over the lid, not taking it too high up in the crease, keeping it just on this lid area. So that yellow is super vibrant. So I mean, yellow totally isn't a color I'd wear every day, but I think just for something different, maybe you know a special party or even a festival, this would be so awesome. So I'm pretty much done on the top lash line area now. So I'm gonna head into my lower lash line and I'm gonna go in with more of a goldy orange, burnt orange shade. I think that really ties in with the yellow and it'll just make my eyes really pop. I'm just gonna smudge this into my lower lash line. It actually makes the yellow pop a bit more. Okay, so now that I have the lipstick everywhere that I kind of want it, all over the lid, I'm taking the Urban Decay Single Shadow in the shade Sideline, throwing it at myself, and then applying it. So I thought I could live with the harsh edges, but <laughs> not that kind of gal, so I'm going in with the Mecca Cosmetica Blending Brush, just with the same eyeshadow and blending out the harsh lines in the crease. So I'm pretty happy with how my color has come along. Now I'm gonna finish off with a gorgeous Kevin Aquan lid gloss, and I'm just gonna pop this in the center of my lid to give my eyes that really big pop. I'm literally just gonna use my finger, because I feel like it's the best way to apply a gloss. Do it, yeah, because you don't wanna disturb it too much. Yeah, yeah, exactly, and I don't want the color underneath to move. So I'm just gonna pop that right in the center. Oh my God, yes. So while you do that, I'm just going with some Better Than Sex mascara all over my lashes. All right, I think I'm, I'm, I'm done, done now. You're done too? Oh my God, timing, yes. You're just a little sun droplet, aren't Aww. you? Stunning. Thank you. All right, cool, so do you wanna try something new? Let's go. Awesome. So another trend we've been seeing a lot on the runways has been graphic eyeliner. So today we're gonna to show you how to get it from runway to real way. <laughs> So I'm using the By Terry Stylo Black Star. Mm -hmm. Really cult product, amazing cream eyeshadow stick. Stunning. I'm going in with Black Track from MAC, the Pro Long Wear Liner, and the 263 brush. So I'm focusing my graphic liner on the lower lash line today, whereas you're going I'm for- I'm going for the top, yeah, like full top really heavy. bold. Let's do it. So I think the easiest way to kind of do this is just to follow my crease and go slightly above, just to really kind of carve it out yeah, and then cool. take it out, yeah. And same goes with me, even though I'm doing it on the bottom lash line, I'm really just following the line of my lower lash line, leading up towards the outer point of my brow. What I love about this cream eyeshadow stick as well is that it can be used in the waterline, so I'm coloring that in as well. And I'm just connecting my bottom waterline to the line I just created. Oh, check that out. Oh, yes. Oh. Mine's kind of like an upside down wing. Stunning. Really. So we so match, I mean, but like not. Like, yeah. yeah, but nah. So I'm just filling this in now really quickly before it all sets. Now the trickiest part is to get the other eye to match, isn't it? I'm dreading it. I'm almost finished this and I'm like, wow, this one turned out really well, but I'm like, are they gonna be sisters or twins? <laughs> so on this side, I'm kind of going for a different approach just so I can make sure they match. So I'm angling my brush towards the end of my brow. I'm gonna stop right about there, connect it, and hope that they're the same. So again, just taking some Bed Than Sex mascara and just coating my top lash line. 
I think I'm done. Donny, check it. How do we feel? Yeah, you look so good. Okay. I feel like Cleopatra, but modern day Cleopatra. Like Rebez. Yeah. So even though this trend was meant to be like really out there, I think it can be super wearable. I yeah. mean, yours is very wearable. Mine's probably a little bit more OTT. Mm, I'm obsessed, like not gonna lie. Like you're totally gonna wear that out. I really am. Yeah. All right, let's try one more and really push the limits. Newsflash guys, brows are back, and this time they're back bigger and better, bolder, badder, with glitter, color, and that's what we're doing right now. I'm gonna be doing colored brows, and you're doing glitter. Stunning, let's get into it. So I'm starting off with the Urban Decay Single Shadow in the shade Relish, just with my angled brush. And I'm using the Stila Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow, and I'm literally just taking the doe foot applicator and applying it straight onto my brows. I'm just feathering this like pretty much the same way I would feel in my brows if I was using a powder. Let me have a look at yours. I mean, she's Ooh. coming along. Yeah. She's red. Check this out. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. Look at wow. Phoebe Princess. All right. So I feel like we're done with the shadow. Yep. I really want to see how you do this. I'm just going to. You're going in. Yeah. Just going straight in. Ham. Going in with the disposable spoolie. Ooh. I'm scared. And it's a bit metallic as well. It so it's is. Look awesome. Okay. All right, let's do it. Let's go. Whoa. Yeah, that's so nice. Okay. That the reds really brought it together. Okay, cool. It's adding a lot of like texture. Dimension. Yeah. I was thinking dimension. Still Whoa. going for that bushy brow look, even with glitter. I love like brushing up my that's brows. That's really cute. Glitter brows, perfect for a festival. And it's one of those things that you can do kind of last minute or if you don't really know what look to wear, this is super simple. It's one product, just run it through your brows and you're done. Woo! I feel like you're done. It's like metallic and beautiful and we're just glowing together Just now. really cute. I'm gonna put on some mascara though because we need some sort of contrast. Yes. Final touch. Oh, here we go. I mean, <sighs> it's a moment. Who am I? Who is she? I don't know. <laughs> so today we've tried out some pretty crazy beauty trends. Let us know in the comments what videos you'd like to see next. Make sure you like and subscribe for more videos. And until next time, we'll see you guys soon. Bye.